Welcome back to the Snail Cafe. Welcome back. It's Monday. It's elephant time. It's time is... to feed the fire elephant nation. Yes, it is elephant time. <laughs> Alright, All right, so, we, yep, we just arrived at Nightingale City. We are the last elephant. The last nomad. Er, nomad. <gasps> Nightingale City is the capital of the kingdom. To the north is Sunder Garden, City of the Dead, and to the east is Freehaven, the Makani's attempt at a sustainable political unit. Okay. Cool. Thanks for the info dump. Oh god, the warrior pacifist. It's an elephant! Oh, it's a pretty elephant. I like it. Oh, we have shops here. Who are you? How do you like my new paint shop? I went for Razor Red this time. I can't wait to show my friends at tomorrow's party. I don't know who you are. Oh. oh la la, the latest styles of the season can only be found in Nightingale City. What will, will it be today, my friend? Are these all the same options as- No, these no. are different. I think I got a sack boy option. Denim. Panda. That one's cute. I know you wanted a pink elephant, I don't like that one. Wow! <laughs> oh, that's cute. That one's cool, yeah. No. That's horrible. That's so bad. Well, we're gonna... Oops, I almost bought something. Thankfully I didn't have the coin. Yeah, I like the one we have. Yeah, we're gonna stick with the last elephant. The last air number. The last air yeah. elephant. Hi, you made it! This is Nightingale City! You already knew that though. I wanted to show you the temple and the rest of the monks. I can't wait to see their grandmaster's face when he sees you. But the queen has issued a demand to meet you and I really don't think I should keep her waiting. Where's Sandra? Oh, she went up ahead towards the castle. I don't know. She seemed a little nervous to be here for some reason and dodged out of sight pretty quickly. I don't trust her, Yona. I think there's something she's not telling us. Did I screw up again? Should I have kept a better eye on her? Discovery she's up to no good? I agree with you. She's really weird and probably up to no good, but yeah, you did good, Kai. I'll go find this castle and see if I meet some Dara along the way. Hey, Yona? Good luck with the queen. Yeah, I don't trust that girl either. I'm happy. Who, who's that? Hey. Um, Her Highness wishes to speak with you. She'll be waiting in the throne chamber. I suggest you head there right away. Ah. Though I will return to my grave in the Sunder Garden someday, I have been staying here in Nightingale City for over 120 years. It's a fascinating place and a very curious thing to watch a city grow like this one have. Okay. Oh, this is a train station. Oh wait, pots. Thank you. I was supposed to dog there to save the train station. Maybe. This just in Elephant Yona has arrived in Nightingale City Queen Sintaria has issued a demand to meet with our new elephant. Will Yona agree to meet with the Queen? What does her highness have to say to him? Stay tuned for further development. Feel free to tune in anytime you want an update or reminder of what's going on right now. Oh cool. So whenever we stop playing this game for more than a day we can go back. Yeah and be and like tell what us are we to supposed go? to do? The castle? Nope. Um, I, don't I don't think I have enough, but I'll talk anyways. Oh, I do have enough. Well, shit. Thank you. Oh, probably up there. Okay. Are you ready? <gasps> I'm Mimi. And then Mono, we are twins! We are looking for our lost dog, Mello. He ran away and hasn't come back. Oh, no. If you see him, please bring him back to us, please. Oh no, poor kids. That's so sad. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. 
Oh, I lose my water between things. Yep. Oh. Um, um. Nope. I do not like this place. I want the axe. <clears throat> I am the queen's executioner. We often like to forget, but even noble political power is fundamentally an extension of the physical power of violence. Okay, good talk, buddy. Bye-bye. Never see you again. Until it becomes a plot point that I have to talk to Please you. Please not. But... <laughs> Is that the case for an elephant? Yeah, I feel like we're gonna be stuck in here at some point. Uh, I don't like it. Maybe I should just leave the city. Yeah, <laughs> if we could, we probably would. Break, break, break. Maybe we will be putting that little shell we go for breaking everything though. Maybe. I mean, we kind of deserve it. Nah, we're a good elephant. Destroying everything we see. Do you go Castle on? Garden. Oh, it's so cute. Pick it up. <gasps> Ooh. I can't pick it up. It's super cute, though. No, not you. Please what not you. What the fuck you. are you doing here? <laughs> Over here. Hi, Sundara. What are you doing sneaking around in the Castle Garden? I'm casually avoiding any city guards. But anyway, here's the castle. The queen is waiting for you inside. And what form of intelligence I have gathered, she seems to have something important to say to you. Maybe the end of the world is lurking around the bend after all. Why don't we step inside and meet her then? Maybe you can introduce me? No, sorry, but I can't go inside with you. Maybe somebody might recognize me and we wouldn't want that. I just wanted to make sure you found your way to the castle, but I'll sneak off now, avoiding suspicion. I'll find that goof Kai and meet you downtown, okay? Good luck with the queen. Um, I don't trust you. Nope. Uh, not a bit. And I don't like you. Not that either. I hope the guards recognize you. Oh, Turtle! Turtle friend! <laughs> turtle friend, we have much to do. No, we'll go in the castle and then the turtle will disappear. No, Turtle, you have to come with me to meet the queen. Nope. You are my friend. Nope. I must bring you. <gasps> he came with me! This is so cute. <laughs> I love it. Wish we could also paint the turbo. Oh, that'd be so adorable. Nope. Nope. The queen can wait. There's one on the other side too. Excuse me, your majesty. I'm just poor. Oh. Elephant Yono. We are Her Highness Queen Cynthia the First. News of your arrival has preceded you. Elephant Yono, it seems our the old monks were right that an elephant would appear in our time of need. Your Highness, I'm glad to be of assistance. Wait, time of need? What does that mean? Our daughter is missing. The young princess has been kidnapped. We assume you have come here to find her. Well, I will certainly do my best to help out. A missing child is a serious matter. Your royal offering or not. Our baby girl has been stolen from us. Worry not, your highness. I'll find the lost princess. Who will have taken her, do you think? Those walking corpses from Sundergarden, we're sure. Rumor has it they steal human children all the time to use in dark rituals which keep them alive, or else to perform sickening experiments on. Stop being racist, that's probably wrong. We never thought the Bone Whites would have the nerve to stretch out their profane fingers towards the royal family. Your Highness, I have met a few bone whites and I wouldn't say they seem the kind to steal babies. Or else it's the Makani who are behind this. We have known for a very long time that unrest is growing in Freehaven, and this could very well be part of some barbaric coup to bargain away their trade taxes. Those clockwork brains of theirs shrewdly can be shrewdly political, and their lack of human emotions make robots ruthless and unpredictable. I see. Your Highness, let me investigate this matter. I'll do whatever I can to get the missing princess safely back to you, and we know it's Sundara. Most likely. 
At first, we didn't believe in elephants, but since you are here now, we'll expect you to be able to solve this with ease. At least that's the impression we have gotten from the stories, that your kind can move mountains, end wars, and align planets. With such immense power, we expect you to be able to find our kidnapped daughter and punish those responsible accordingly. I'll do my best, your highness. That was something. Yeah, I don't like her. Nope. Hmm. I don't want to help her. I want to check out the City of the Dead, though. That sounds Oh, yeah, cool. that sounds really cool. <gasps> More turtle friends. Really? What? You should replace your friend with another friend. I can't grab more than one at a time. Then stop replacing them. I don't like you. You're the missing princess. Hi, ho. How was your meeting with the queen? Intense character, isn't she? You are right, Sundara. There is a great calamity happening to the kingdom, which I was sent to repair. I know what it is now. Let me guess. The princess is missing. Why, yes. How do you know that? I'm the missing princess, silly. And I'd rather it stay that way for at least a little while longer. You're the princess? Then what are you doing out here? Your mother's very worried about you. I just ran away a little, okay? Have you have any idea what it's like? Uh, what life is in the court? Like, uh, blah. Bad. Shut up. <laughs> it's all polite conversation here. Respectful bows there, exquisite food, fancy dresses. Have you tried making a somersault in a dress? No, I haven't. Well, I had to get away from it for a little while. Please don't make me go back in there. My mom will throw a fit if she sees my hair like this. And I want to travel the world. I want to see Sunder Garden and Freehaven too. And I want to do all kinds of weird stuff. Are you sure? Your mother seemed rather upset. Perhaps it will be better to let her know where you're going. Oh, you are clearly not familiar with my mother. We have a world to save. You and I, that monk boy, and even if the world is in trouble, not in trouble yet, then maybe we have to cause some first? I don't like her. Just bring her back. Yeah, go, go on. Push her get back. In get inside. Go back go, to talk to the queen. Inside. Go inside. Get inside. Go get the queen. By the yep. way, your daughter is sitting outside in the garden. I don't think that will work, though. I don't think it will work. I will be amazed if it worked. Oh. Find our missing princess. I'm on it, your highness. She's outside. Why? I know we need this to be plot for the game, but just give her back already. I, don't know. I like how she casually just admits it to you. Like it's oh, she's not, a kid. It's not, it's not like she's like pretending or anything. She's just like, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's me. Oh, we got loud here. Are people talking about us? Have you heard about that elephant? He's just the one that goes everything. around breaking everybody's pots. Yes, I've seen them. Something has to be done about that. Nothing there. There was a Nexus before. But what? Sign painting workshop. Providing the world with signs. Whatever. That is okay. Oh, hello. hello! I have a health token, which I won in the lottery, but I don't have any use for it myself. I know, why don't you take it? You can trade it in at the health token exchange service. Okay. Well, thank you. That was very nice of you. Yeah. I mean, they don't need health, they're dead. And we leave that way to the left now. Yeah, I think so. Okay, yeah, there's something else down here. Oh, the person there, the one by the fountain, is the one who tells you what's on the left, what's on the right, what's on... Yeah, I know. What way to the dead people city? Left. Okay. 
Your left up. Why? Because I could. That's mean. You're I don't good, care. You're a rude elephant. I have to practice my water bending. On random people. Yes. Hello, chicken friend. Chicken seems perfectly fine there. Oh, we're in the Fire Nation. Oh, no. Ooh. It's just the urban temple. I brew your bob. Kai was speaking true. A new elephant has arrived. It amazes me that you're here, and also that the first of our author who should stumble upon you was none other than Kai, the inept adept. I sent him on a um, pilgrimage, shall we say, to Wind Hills mostly to get him out of the temple for a little while. He's a very good little boy, bless his poor soul, but for all his good intentions he has a way of fumbling any that's given to him, and he can become something of a burden. I trust you intend to begin your journey across the world shortly. Young Kai seems anxious to show you on your travels, and perhaps it is for the best for everyone involved if you took him with you. Okay, I'm taking the gift. Alrighty. Nobody wants him. Welcome to Nightingale Temple. There used to be many like these all over the world, but in these days there aren't many monks or temples left. I hope this will change now that another elephant does appear. The fire may should kill them all. Whoa. I like learning about the elephants of the past. They are like celebrities to us monks. Oh, it's a dead baby monk. Whoa. There's a robot monk! Are you surprised to see a mechanic monk? Unlike the humans, we Mekani do not have a long tradition of elephant contact. Our entire history up until now has played out without elephant influence. But I still think elephants are an important aspect of this world, and so I have chosen to live in this temple as a monk. Okay, sure. That's cute. I am the elephant! Adore me! Serve me food! What? Okay, wow! Welcome back to the land of the living! Oh, ah, a new elephant! I suppose it is about time. It'll feel like only yesterday I said my farewells to Naga. You spoke to Naga? Was she another elephant like me? Oh, yes, she was, young one. The sixth, in fact, in a long line of noble elephants. That should make you the seventh. Naga left this world 1,000 years ago, and now the planet have once again aligned, a new millennium has begun, and here you are. Does that make you a thousand years old? Yes. We bone whites do not age like humans, we do not get ill, and we do not die. This is all because of Naga, who used her elephant magic to bless the soul of the Thunder Garden. We who fester in the ground rose from the dead and were granted life eternal. Many has risen since, but I was one of the first to sprout out of the earth, and I am old enough to have a Naga herself in person. Uh, I wish I could learn more about the deeds of the past elephants. I feel like everyone else has such clear expectations of what I'm supposed to do. They seem to have a better understanding of what an this elephant really is, is Avatar. <laughs> than I do myself. It is. Ha, ah, you're in luck, young one. They don't call me the lore master for nothing, you know. You may think the people above know all about elephants, but the truth is most stories and tales have been forgotten. I bet most people these days didn't even believe in elephants until you show up. I, who do not eat and do not sleep, have devoted my existence to collecting and preserving elephant lore. These books and scrolls you see around you are filled with legends and historical accounts of elephant accomplishments all the way back to Yen and Agra, who came to this world when the humans were still living in caves and feeding off roots and berries. So, you can teach me all about the other elephants then? Alas, I wish I could, I really do, young one, for knowledge exists for sharing, but it is with great shame that I admit that the library had fallen into disarray over the past centuries. Entropy is the one force that pervades the universe, and sooner or later we must all decay. 
Most of the paragraphs here collected have simply slipped off the pages and been scattered to the wind. It will be a great task indeed to collect all the lost letters and leaves and put them back into the books in the correct order. Maybe I can help? Yes, maybe you can. Though your sh through your shortness you may happen upon lost letters half haphazardly, haphazardly <laughs> hidden in bushes and shards. Collect as many as you can and bring them back here. I will then carefully place each letter where it belongs and the ancient text will once again emerge. Only then will you be able to read the stories within. Do you understand the project? Yes, I think I do. Grand! I would like nothing more than to see this wealth of knowledge restored. Here, let me give you the handful of letters I have managed to pick up in, my, in this room. They shall be enough to piece together a chapter or maybe a few paragraphs. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, I see you have some letters to me. Let's see if we can piece something together. Um, I'm a little confused. We have but... 2,300 letters and we can start getting them in order to do that. Oh, here we go. Uh, do we want to read all this right now? Um... No. Okay. This is the story of the Sunder Garden. Nope. Not enough. Alright, let's go get more letters. Okay. Bye-bye! Next time I come here, I want a celebration in my honor, please. <laughs> what? I am the elephant. The one and we only. We are the one and only elephant. Ooh. Elephants are awesome. This is the elephant temple where monks await the next appearance. Yes, I know I am the elephant. <gasps> Good day, Mr. Elephant. <gasps> I'm Trixie the Magnificent, a magician and street performer, or at least I used to be. One day the wind blew my top hat right off my noggin and stole it away. Without my hat, there's very little I can do. So all my magic is apparently stuffed in my hat. Mm -hmm. All I have now is this antique music box, and it's not nearly as interesting as my old act. Oh, well. So Sucks for you. you. You want your hat back, okay. Oh. Good day, Mr. Elephant. Oh, there's a hat. That's not how you wear a hat, Elephant. He's doing his best. What? What? Okay. Here, take oh, your hat. That's my hat. Did you retrieve it for me? Certainly. Magnificent. Now I'll be able to perform again, and I won't need this antique music box anymore. You can take it if you want. Someone else might be looking for it. What, did you fucking steal it? Who else would be looking for it? Oh, I love it, though. It's adorable. I don't want to get rid of it. Do you need to find whoever is looking for it, I guess? It's Ooh. a fetch quest? Yeah, one of those uh, trade quests, I guess. Ooh. There's a boy across town who I really like, but I am much too shy to ever go up and talk to him. What should I do? Maybe I can help? Oh, wow. Would you? Would you? I got this bouquet of red roses here. Could you maybe deliver it to him and tell him about me? The boy's name is Garish, and he lives near the Lucky Elephant Tavern. Sure. Um, you have to get the flowers. Yes, I know, but I have a music box instead right now. So first, let's find who the music box goes to. Um, there's a rock. Nope. Oh, there's some treasure on the back. Okay. Let me shoot Bucky so I know him. So I know him. Yay, I found a health token. Are you, not, are you not breaking those? Oh, right. These small ones I can break. Maybe we find letters. Yeah, we find letters. Um. So 
annoying. Nah, it's fine. I actually don't mind it. Oh. Welcome to the Nightingale City Dogs. Do you have anything to declare? Nah, I'm just missing. What do you do here? Nightingale City is engaged in loads of maritime trade, mostly with Freehaven and other poor cities along the coast. This is the office where you present your ships, manifest, and pay the tariff place on all trades by the Queen. We import manufactured goods from the robots in Freehaven, and the ships coming in from here pay large taxes to the Nightingale Kingdom, so we humans benefit twice on every trade. Oops. Oh well. Pay your taxes! That's what it says. Ooh. Doesn't matter. Uh, yep, I'm Sewer Warden. My name is Swampy. I'm responsible for keeping the Nightingale Sewer in proper working order. It's an important job, alright, but my real dream is to look for hidden treasure. I have been searching in the sewers throughout the years, but I would like to expand my hunt to the mountains or perhaps to the bottom of the seas. There should be a lot of treasure at the bottom of the sea, don't you think? Sadly, I lack the equipment to go find it. Um, do I have to find the equipment too? Yono, I am a sculptor and working on a marble statue of you. Oh, what do you thank think? you. It's an artistic representation. Keep up the good work. It's terrible. What the fuck do I have to give this music box to? No, 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 that was sad. No, it wasn't. Where does the music box respawn? On the floor, maybe? <gasps> I love the music box. <laughs> Oopsies. Oh, the rose girl's on the right, I think. On the right? No, she's right here. Oh, okay. Yoink. What was the name? Oh no, we'll find some guy. Hey. Welcome to Nightingale City. It was a guy by the dog, I saw it said. Uh, we are by the dog. Ooh. No, that's not him. Grishmi, Grish, something like that. Maybe it wasn't by the dog, maybe it was something else. She said where it was. By a tavern. Right. Ooh. I don't- I haven't seen a tavern anywhere that- oops, that's uh, not- Nope. Yeah. <laughs> that's a nope. <gasps> Welcome to Madame Pompadour. I'm the greatest fortune teller in the land. Let me tell you about your future. Ooh, I see the paw of a monkey and a dusty old artifact. You will find this object when you do. You will bring it to me. Are you looking for a monkey's paw? Yes, yes I am. Ah, people! I hate humans. Um. What? You almost fell. I was like, Nah, no, I'm good. Where's the tavern? <laughs> That's a train station. That leads out of here. Yes. That looks kind of like a this tavern. This kind of looks like a tavern, yeah. So maybe around here somewhere? Maybe in the tavern itself? Oh, there's fire down there. Uh, why don't you go to that house? It was by the tavern, not in the tavern. Well, let's check out the tavern, too. Oh. Welcome to the Lucky Elephant Tavern. It is a honor to have you in the kingdom, Elephant Chuno. Let me offer you a mug of warm milk to restore your strength. Oh, thank you. Very kind. Though I would have preferred beer. Yeah, right? So I came all the way to a tavern and you give me milk. Hey, it's a Zelda trope. That's stupid. I can only imagine going to a real life tavern. Hey. Ha ha ho ho he he. He he. Ah. I just saw it for a really funny show. Oh, never mind. Only me and my baby brother will get it. Sure. Take some more tavern. Why are there so many books in the tavern? It's a book cafe? There's no tables. 
Why do people sit in this tavern? I don't understand it. Maybe that way it's empty. Bad business there. Good name. Is is it this? Yes. yes. Are these from Julie? I can't believe it. She has noticed me after all. My dad won't let me outside much, so I've spent a lot of time writing poems for my unattainable Juliet. Will you deliver them from her from me? As a response for the roses, there are quite a few. Okay. Uh, sure thing. I'm gonna break all your pots, though. I charge in pots. Ooh, there's an R. Before we check the fire, let's just deliver those. Where are you? The trade between human and mechanic goes by sea between Nightingale City and Freehaven, but it is entirely controlled by the Nightingale City. They force us to pay high taxes and tariff on everything we trade, which means Freehaven remains a scrappy outpost. We are trying to find ways of getting around the tariff, if you know what I mean. I have a fake manifest here for a shipment of manufactured goods from Freehaven, but it needs an official stamp before we can show it to the harbor master. Luckily, we have a human sympathizer who works in the Queen's Guards and has better access to official documents. Could you take this fake cargo manifest to our friend in the Queen's Guard, get it stamped, and then give it to the harbor master? The harbor master office is by the dog downtown from the Elephant Temple. Um, our sympathizer guard is the fourth guard from the entrance in the Queen's throne room. Um, that's illegal, but sure, because fuck the monarchy. Yeah, we should do this for them, one thing at a time, because we'll keep getting quests, and we can only do one at a time. Oh no. <gasps> Welcome to Madame Max Mel. I am your go-to fortune teller for all things psychic. What can I tell you? What can I tell you about your future, my dear? What can you tell me? Absolutely nothing. That's what. Without my crystal ball, I am helpless in the in the void beyond. My no good sister is Nicta, and I'm trying to use it trying to use it for herself, despite having no talent whatsoever in matters of clairvoyance. Your sister is she a medium as well? Well, I'd say she's more of a small. Oh, I get it. Um, took me a second. <laughs> yeah, I need but it. here you come. A, a tall, dark stranger to fetch my crystal ball back for me now. Um, I'll see what I can do. People. I'm this, the this is like the biggest, like, trade fetch quest, like, the series that I'm going to have to do. But I was about to say, we do not have to do this. These are all side yes, quests. Yes, we have to do this. I thought they were all side quests. I... I have to do this. There's too many. I should want to progress in the game. This is part of progressing in the game. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Let me see for It's not like there's much to combat in this game. No, but I want to go. Yay, it respawned. City. Good. But we still don't know who Oh, he responded. I can't believe it. My love is not unrequited after all. I always knew, you know, in the bottom of my heart, as they say. I'm going to read all of these poems, and then I'm going to write a long love letter in reply. How about maybe meeting him in person? Oh, no. There's going to be a long time before I work up the courage to do that. Sure, whatever. Yay, letters. Now you can't write. I stole your letters. <laughs> that is true. So we need the monkey paw to get the crystal ball. We need so much shit. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> First, I feel like something is a bit more urgent. There's a fire. No, it was just a... Um... Yeah, there's a fire. I know, but didn't you see? It was just like on purpose, not like a, something on fire. I don't trust it. Let's go put out the fire. People might be mad if you do that. Oh yeah, this is on purpose. Yeah. Sure doesn't look like it's on purpose. That way you don't get to sewers. Oh, sewers. Gloop, gloop, gloop. Hello, what are you doing down here? I'm the Phantom of the Nightingale Sewers. I've been living down here in solitude for hundreds of years. Doesn't it get lonely? I like the loneliness. I used to live up in the city. In the middle of things, I was in love with a beautiful human woman. And what happened? She died. 
Oh no! A trash that that fork you got into the sewers? No, she could roll and died peacefully of high age. She was a human, you know. We had a wonderful life together while she was alive, but uh, all life decays, and uh, when my love was gone, I had little reason to stay on the surface. So now I live by myself in the darkness. In mourning? Not really. We both knew she would not live forever. Creatures die. Time moves on. <laughs> it's the way we were. It's the way of the world. We fun whites live without much attachment to the physical realm, and because of this, uh, not much can disturb us. I value the time I had together with my love. I treasure the memories of it, but I can't go back to it, and I do not yearn for the impossible. Um, okay. You are the most level-headed NPC I've ever met in a game. <laughs> yeah. Well, goodbye. Yeah, uh, good, good, good meeting you. Maybe we'll find the love also as a... As a skellyman? Yeah. <gasps> uh, ahoy, matey. I used to be a fearsome pirate off the coast of Freehaven, but avast, you pirate life ain't what it used to be, I tell you that. Bit, bit torrents and all that are just so much harder nowadays. You but... need a VPN, if not your ISP contacts you. It's, it's difficult. Uh, the Queen's forces are keeping a watch, close watch over Freehaven these days. The last beacon of anarchy stifled upon the iron fist of the monarchy. I, I long for the golden days of your the salty air in ye face, the rolling sea under ye feet. Okay. Good talk. Good talk. Bye. Bye bye. Do any of you fuckers want a music box? Maybe the robot. Maybe the what? The robot. Oh yeah, I guess that robot is technically a person, huh? <laughs> Good day, Mr. Elephant. No. Can you do that with the robot? No. Damn it. I don't remember who was in here anymore. Alright, you want the crystal ball, so I need This to is a legal one. We want the papers to go to the castle to go to the garden. First go to the garden, go to the dogs, then go back there. Hi. Nobody look at the good elephant doing bad stuff, please. I am not doing anything illegal. Just a favor for a good citizen. Yes. These are these are legal things I am doing as an elephant savior of the world. Fourth guard to the left or to the right? I believe it's fourth guard from the entrance. I said there was a roll to the left and one from the right, but maybe no. No. What happens if we try to give it to the wrong one? I don't know. Let's not find out. Okay, we'll do These that. fetch quests are long enough as they are. I really don't need to find out. One, one two, two, three, three four. four. Are you the one who can get an official stamp onto these documents? Shh, not so loud. The way we treat the mechanic of Freehaven is shameful, and on top of that, it's all holding us back. We humans can benefit greatly from the robot industry and manufactured goods, but instead we are starving them for resources, which keeps their production at an infantile state. Take this stamp manifest of the harbor master near the docks. Freehaven thanks you. Let's roll it. Nobody saw that. Yeah, the guards are just standing there like, what the fuck just happened? Why did that elephant bring him a book? Why did he stamp the book and give it back to the elephant? Why was he? Shh! <laughs> Nothing suspicious here. No. Nope. Yes. Ignore me. I am the good elephant. I am a good elephant. Please ignore. I do not do illegal things. So I am not carrying an illegal book. Please get out of my way. Do not question elephants. So the nope. not there. So the title of the episode will be Fetch Quest. Something like that, yeah. For sure. Hello. Ooh. Welcome to the Nightingale City Docks. Do you have anything to declare? I do, in fact. I am delivering the manifest for a shipment coming in from Freehaven. Perfect! And it already has a proper stamp, I see. Everything should be in order then. Here's a coin for your trouble. You, you threw it behind you where I can't get it, you jackass. Okay. And now let them know that we've got it? I guess so. Also. Fuck your shit! Fuck the monarchy! Yeah, down with the monarchy! Uh, where was that date again? 
in the other end of the city. Okay. Nope. <laughs> this city is way too big. It's not that big. I know, it's just annoying to navigate. I wish I had a run button. Just for stuff like this. Wish you could typically fly like it Dumbo. Typically it wouldn't be necessary, but... Fly like Dumbo. Yeah, or if I could fly like Dumbo. There. All right, I have done it. Take the fake cargo manifest to the fort guard, blah, blah, blah. You already did that. I already did that, you fucking clown. So there's no, nothing. What the hell? Well, no price, just that coin. We did this one already. I know. Money. Without to her. Yeah. Bye bye. It feels like there was like no point to doing that quest. Nope. You know what? It probably comes back up in Free Haven itself. At some point, we'll figure out a way to get there. Whoa. Oh! Oh. You know, I built a music book for my love centuries ago. I wonder what happened to it. If you find the music box in the city, I would be interested in getting it back. The song it played was composed by my love and I built it into the box. Maybe I could play it again on the pipe organ. Okay. Okay. I'll do that for you. Yeah. And that might be the last quest for today. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go get our friend the music box. Why do you want to die so bad? Shut up. It's, it's sad being the last elephant alive, okay? It's not that you're the last elephant alive, it's you're the first elephant alive. You know? No, I'm the seventh elephant alive. I guess that's true. You're the seventh. You're like a whole caveat. Yes. <laughs> so many references! Yoink! <laughs> you're the last... The last elephant? The last air elephant and also the seventh Hokage. <laughs> Don't fall to the water, please. I somehow didn't break it over there. Oh, you found my old music box. I have not heard this melody in over a century. This was my last connection to the upper world. Now that I have the music box, I'm ready to descend further into the dark so that I can focus exclusively on my music. I will not eat, I will not sleep until my masterpiece is complete. I will emerge again a hundred years from now with the most sublime symphony the world has ever heard. I will compose it from shadows and solitude, and it will bring tears of joy to the eyes of anyone who listens. Okay. Oh! Okay! Bye bye. So I it's cool that his music is still playing. But treasure! Yeah, I was seeing what else was here. Treasure! Health token. Those are useful. Drop the box or put the other one. <gasps> the, the dog! dog! Ah. Wait, what? Oh, the lost dog! Yeah! How did you get here, dog? I don't have a key. Maybe the sign there says how to get the key. Is there a sign there? Yeah. Looking for the Looking key. Looking for the key? Yeah. Seek out the sewer warden, Mr. Swampy. Oh. Um, okay. Let's deliver the dog. Yeah. Are we doing this for today or are we delivering the dog tomorrow? We did say that the other thing would be the last one and it's been 45 minutes. Let's, we will be playing with the dog all night <laughs> and then deliver it tomorrow. We'll, 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 we'll deliver it tomorrow. We'll, we'll play with it all night. Sure. 
Oh, have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye.